we need to look at whether the asset class is suitable for long-term investors, and the answer is yes. I mean, if you look at pension funds, you would know that, for example, in Europe, most of the pension funds are defined benefit schemes. In the US, you've got defined benefit schemes, and they've got long-term liabilities here. Yeah? And then you've had a scenario where, because of quantitative easing, bonds have systematically um, uh, reduced yields, which has pushed up the liabilities of most of the schemes. And to some extent, they are slightly underfunded, so they are looking for growth in terms of investment opportunities. And I think infrastructure as an asset class, it really falls within that category. One, it's long-term, and secondly, the returns can be attractive.